is how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone, warning, what you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Sound good? Sounds good to me. All right, everyone, that is the halfway point of tonight's stream, okay? Thank you to everyone who is chilling. Guys, if you are enjoying the stream tonight and chilling with me, please consider supporting it in various different ways. Number one way, you could like the stream. We're at 51 likes. We are over 200 viewers. We could easily hit 100 likes tonight. If we do that, I'll do a silly, celebratory bubble blow. Now, any other support would be greatly appreciated. Right now, we got one super chat from Evil Gandhi, and we had two tips earlier, and that's it. So, if we could get any other support tonight, thank you in advance. I would really appreciate it. My day off is tomorrow. It would help if I get tips. That helps for my day off tomorrow. Um, all right? I'm not asking that you have to do anything. It's not required, but certainly it would be nice Considering that I'm uh, toughing through the end of this game, I realize it has been a month I've been playing Gotham Knights. I'm trying to finish it for you guys so we can move on to other stuff, okay? <clears throat> Alright, thank you in advance for anything in the next hour. Let's, uh, let's continue. Okay. Rogando Cerdo. You know, oh, he's an e-beggar. What the hell kind of game is this? What a poorly made game. Seriously, now I'm dead. You've got to be kidding me. That is incredibly poorly made. You kill the man bat. You kill the man bat, but you didn't fight his dumb fuck minions. What the fuck? You kill the man bat. His minions show up. Oh, fuck that. I want to fight them. You fly away. Oh, you go back. Oh, the man bat survived. Fuck your mother. No, really, game devs. Like, what the fuck is your problem, you ass? Oh my god, he's drinking salt. I was gonna move my attack. He kept me from behind. I can't hit him. Dude, what, what happened? Oh, fuck this. This is terrible. I can't hit him. I'm attacking him. All the attacks are going through his body and not hitting him. And now I fucking just die out of nowhere. This sucks ass. This whole thing sucks ass. This is the end of the game. This is terrible. This is really badly done. What the fuck? You fucking idiots. This is so bad. This is really bad, man. What the fuck were they thinking with this part? What a bunch of idiots. Wow. Not only do I have to fight a man bat that takes an entire health bar with two hits, it's way that's more that's powerful than the one you just fought in the story. Also, it spawns enemies that come from behind you and all hit you at the same time. All you can taste is salt. What the fuck? This is fucking idiotic nonsense is what it is. It's fucking terrible. I couldn't take it. The end is just so annoying. I couldn't take it, dude. I quit. Yeah, man, it was too hard. It was too tedious. I quit it. <laughs> I don't want to keep losing resources, so I'm going to try to reload and see from a checkpoint if it doesn't do this. So, now the other one I beat. The other bat I beat. So, is, th is this one at Elliot? Is this harder than the other one? Because the other one I already, I already fought and won. But now this one I can't beat at all. What the fuck? What a bunch of fucking... Oh, you're going to get salt, 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 salt. It's oh, even now, I'm getting my mouth overpowered with salt flavor. Did you say it was level 28? I'm only like level 25, right? Why the fuck am I fighting level 28 enemies? Support's been very, very slow tonight. Ugh. <sighs> So that's one down, and it better register as one down. Okay, so now if I go back to the tower, to the belfry, I should recharge on healing and everything. Which I need to do. There's no way with two healing I'm going to beat the next one. Uh, thanks for being a great audience. Absolute last chance if you would like to support the stream in any way. Whether it simply be a like or anything else. Super chat, tip, etc. That would be the time and I would appreciate it if you could. That's not begging. That's business. This is so fun. I literally did second wind and the game said, oh fuck you, you're just gonna die anyway. He rage quit! He rage quit! Oh my god, he rage quit! Are you fucking serious? There's no way to do this. It's impossible. For some reason, my special ability has no effect on the man bat. You notice that, right? My special ability doesn't work. It works on everyone but not man bat. And man bat's only two levels above me. Only two. Yeah, for some reason, the game acts like it's 10 or 12. Where I can't even hit him with a special move. It does absolutely nothing. Right? That is the stupidest fucking thing I've ever seen. All I can do, I can try it one more time. That's it. After that, fuck it. It's so dumb. What's the point? <laughs> Unreal. 
Oh my god, they fucked up. I can't believe they fucked up the end so bad. They they misleveled the band bat. It's supposed to be only level 24 to 25. They made two level 27 and they made one level 28. That's not even correct. That's not even the. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to be <laughs> I need Jane Alyssa Jessica the end. <laughs> Dude, I keep losing all my health to nothing. What the fuck? Look at my health, come on, man. Oh, fuck, this is impossible. It's literally impossible, I'll never win it. This is the end of the game for me. This is literally the end of the game. I don't know how I'm supposed to beat that, I really don't. Special shout out to YouTubers talking shit about me in vlog videos, uh, apparently yesterday and today, calling me a rage quitter when I've never rage quit ever in my entire entirety of existence on YouTube. Never once rage quit, ever. Well, apparently people think I'm a rage quitter. I'm not even getting hit anymore. There's things off screen. They're hitting me like, what the fuck? This really sucks. This is the end of the game. The end of the game is terrible. This is really one of the worst endings I've seen anyone do. There's no reason to fight three of them. And one of them is always two levels above you, which means you can't really hear it. And then it fucking hits you for two hit kills. Like, what the fuck? They fucked this up bad. I can't believe it. Because actually, like I said, as much as I feel that the reviewers were unfair about the game, because they said it was a grind. There's no grind here. Even if you grind endlessly here, he's still two levels above you. So it's actually not a grind. It's that the end was completely poorly executed. I don't even know how I'm going to beat that. I really don't. I don't know how I'm going to beat that. How am I going to be able to kill that bat and two other fucking enemies at the same time and then it can infinitely resummon the enemies? And I can't accurately freeze it because it's too fucking, uh, because it's too, uh, resistant to elements. I don't know, man. That's pathetic. That's just absolutely pathetic. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Because now the thing is, like, I don't even know if I play it again. Can I even beat it? Like, I don't even know how to beat that. I think they fucked it up. What I would say is, for those who are still watching the playthrough on YouTube, as few of you as there are, if anyone has any clue what to do to try to beat it, if you leave a comment on the video, let me know. Um, advice is very much warranted at this point. It sucks that we're like 20 hours or more into the game, and we're at the very end, and now they're doing this to me, when I have other games that I want to play way more. Like, this is literally the lingering game I can't beat. It never ends. Like, Jesus Christ. I give up. I say I can't beat it. I just fucking give up. I can't let this beat me, but I don't know how to beat it. I don't know how to beat it myself. That's the problem. You know, every other time I've had a backup plan or if it, no, no, no backup plan, just toughing through it somehow worked. I don't know what to do this time. That's it for tonight's Gotham Knights. Hopefully next time I can beat them and we'll give it a shot. If I don't beat, if I play it one more time and I have trouble, I'm just not going to care. Seriously, like, it sucks because I play through the whole game and I like it. And it's like, now you get to the end, you're like, what the fuck did they do here? And I know people want other stuff rather than this, so. All right. Oh my god, what a slow stream. I hope you guys are actively noticing my efforts to not basically eBay. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just letting everything ride. And like, whatever. Whatever happens, happens. If people want to support, great. If not, nothing I can do about it. I'm not going to sit here and talk about it all day. And you haven't noticed, tonight was a night when normally in the past I would have been talking about it all fucking night and I didn't even mention it, right? So... I hope that that makes, I hope it's, it's feeling better for you. All right. Cause I did get legit complaints from viewers. I was getting complaints from other people, other YouTubers and stuff. It's like, I take that to heart. I got a hair in my mouth. Ugh. I take that to heart and I want to change for the better. So I hope that you feel that I'm changing for the better. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you. Please have a good evening. And I hope to see you when I cut back on Thursday. All right. Peace out. Have a good night. Everyone later. Tonight is the slowest night I have seen for support in months. I don't know what's going on. This is ridiculous. And like I said, I need, really need help right now in regards to tips to pay bills. You gotta work Ragnarok streams for the people that are there good, but it's just not a lot of people, just being honest. Um, I'm actually seeing less people for God of War Ragnarok than I saw tonight for Gotham Knights, than I see for Sonic that I see from Modern Warfare. I don't know why it's actually bringing in the least amount of people. In all the games I'm playing right now, it is definitely, for me, the most engaging and interesting game. I really like the plot. I like the combat elements are getting better. Like, I love the game. It might just be there's so many people of mine that, uh, uh, viewers of mine, I should say, that are playing it, that they don't want to attend the streams because they're afraid of spoilers. But I can't imagine that after, now the game's been out almost a week, right? Tomorrow it'll be a week, that most people aren't ahead of me. That's crazy to think that they're not ahead of me in the game. Um... So I can't really explain it. What I would say is if you are actively watching it on demand on YouTube, thank you. Please remember, things like liking those videos and leaving comments is going to help that playthrough tremendously because right now it's not doing so good for whatever reason on the streams. Uh, hopefully on demand it'll do a little better over time. You know what I'm saying? I guess we'll see. It's loving the game though. Absolutely love the game. Gotham Knights tonight. Oh, brother. Well, let me put it this way. I didn't know if I was going to beat the game tonight. I didn't think I was going to. I felt I was going to need two more streams to beat it, okay? Oh my god, he's drinking gin. Yes. Mmm.
the game decided to, in order to finish Chapter 7 and head into the finale of the game, Chapter 8, you needed to fight three of the same exact boss you've already beaten. Now you have to fight three of them in three different parts of Gotham City during these rooftop boss fights, okay? The, the, the boss will randomly decide to summon minions that hinder your boss fight against them. And if you kill the minions, it will summon more. This early on, this is not fun. This isn't fun. It's work. That's what they mean. The game is work. It's not fun. It's work. So basically what they decided to do is make the ending as possibly tedious, annoying, grindy, and just a pain in the ass as possible. And you might say, well, it's not a big deal. You already killed the boss before, right? Well, right. Except these bosses are way higher level than the one you just fought for the story. They made them either equal to your level or one level above, or in one case, one of them is two levels above your level. If you level up to try to say, oh, I'm going to prepare better for the fight. Let me go do some more side content and level up. When you go back to that boss again, it's still two levels above you. The game scales it up. It's work. I don't want to work to eat. So there's literally no way to grind and prepare for the boss. You just have to do it, okay? Problem is, the boss can insta-kill you or kill you with two hits. If you're already fighting the boss and minions at the same time, there's no way to see where the, fight, the, the attacks are even coming from. You just get hit from behind endlessly. You know, I was using Batgirl, who has two revives. I still couldn't do it. I did the, the two two bosses I beat. The third one, that's the one that's artificially made two levels above you. I, I couldn't beat it. I tried multiple times. I couldn't do it. Um, I'm going to have to try again. You know, what we're going to do is one more stream of this game. We're in the end game. Like, this is it. It's this. And then when I beat this, it's the last story legs. That's the end of the, the game. We're there. But they literally put this in as, like, an insanely badly designed, insanely over-the-top, annoying final part leg of the game before you could actually get to the end story. I don't know why. It adds absolutely nothing. You've already fought the boss, so it's not like, oh, this is cool and original and fun. It's not. It's, you have to do it three more times. Like, that's not fun. That's a waste of my time. That's just too much work. I'm serious. If you had made three original bosses to fight, maybe I'd be like, oh, that's neat. Not the same fucking thing this many times. And the fact that you made it artificially hard and you can't even grind to make it easier is preposterous. There are a bunch of ass. I hate to say it. The game was not that bad up to this point. This is the worst part of the game right now that I'm in. Um, so, when I play it again over the weekend, let's hope for the best. Let's hope that I can beat it. Because if I don't beat, I mean, if I can't beat this part, what's the point? People, first of all, I'll be honest with you. People are tired of the game. I know this for a fact. The attendance is low. The views on YouTube are low. The support is, is slow. No one really cares about Gotham Knights anymore. People cared about it three plus weeks ago and it was new. But this was just the game that was balanced with everything else. And everyone wanted me to focus on the other stuff. So I did. You know, I focused on, uh... Uh, Plague Tale Requiem, then we had Modern Warfare, then we had God of War, then we, you know what I mean? We're doing everything else. Um, so this has always been like the lingering game. I want to get it done, but if we play it again and I have trouble and we don't do it, I don't know, man. I don't know if I want to keep wasting night streams on this. Being honest, I feel like it's a waste at this point. I just want to see the game end, and the fact that they're putting this at the end just means they don't know what they're doing as game devs. Uh, it's disappointing, because the rest of the game, I feel that the reviewers were unfair to it. Now, it's hilarious, because none of the game, none of the reviewers mentioned this part. They all just complain about the grindy nature of the game. Literally, this isn't grinding because you can't grind to beat this boss. You just have to somehow magically beat a boss that hits you for two hit kills, has minions that infinitely summons, and you can't really effectively hurt it. Like, wow. Way to ruin the end of your game, right? So anyway, it is what it is. It was a frustrating late night stream. As the game gets, gets further in, it's becoming too much of a chore. It feels like work. I don't want work in my play. The point of playing a game is to be entertained. It's work now. So it becomes work. It's not fun anymore. Why do I want to keep playing the game? I'm not here tomorrow. If you watch any videos on DSP Gaming, please enjoy. I hope you have a safe and fun day tomorrow. And uh, if you happen to watch anything here, if you're enjoying it, please, if you could give the video a like, I would really appreciate that. Um, if you could leave comments on the videos, let me know what you think of the content of the video. Hey, just leave a comment that says, hey, Phil, trying to help you for the algorithm. That would help too. All right. If you're not subscribed to the channel, don't know why you'd be watching this and not be subscribed. I'm being honest. Um... Right now, I'm going to use this channel as a way to communicate with you guys as if it were social media. All right, guys. I think that's enough for me. Oh. <laughs> There's still this back here. And it's still in the back of my neck, the back of my head, the back of my mind. And it's always telling me. It's WWE Champions time. I love it. I love it. Is is a mobile game addict. Still has indoctrinated children who send him money blatantly milking for money it's a money pit it's gone just gone like that in an instant fucking gone i just care about money that i just can't help it by ebay contributions are mandatory but i need your help i am appealing directly to you
No decency, no respect, no common sense, no fucking maturity. Is the guy who just doesn't get reality. <laughs>